What is going on YouTube? <clears throat> it is your boy Xavier here with a brand new video and today we're going to be talking about what Ahmed had to uh, say about rogue slayers and things of that nature. And so uh, let's go ahead and get let's let's go ahead and get into it. So the first thing he said is the self-proclaimed thing wasn't me saying you're not loyal. It's me saying it's your own words. So self-proclaimed means that you yourself claim anything so if i say if i say i'm a reincarnation of some biblical person i'm self-proclaiming that i'm them i'm it's only me claiming it and um my argument against that isn't really a need for an argument i don't need to prove that i've been the most loyal i mean if you look even my own people that watch my videos and people that don't watch my videos who get recommended my channel every single thing there is literally it's literally rogue demon and it's been that for years i don't think i think there's less than 10 videos on this channel out of the 700 i've posted that aren't rogue demon the majority of them being this game rogue slayers and one strongest battlegrounds video that you were aware of or i think it may be two so in terms of loyalty, you name me a content creator who's been as consistent as me, as long term as me and things of that nature. Other, psh, the only one I could I could see aside from me is Michael. And I'm literally 10 feet across from him in another room. He made the argument. He said, you have not spoken a single word to me about this Rogue Slayer game. It's outrageous. You can't argue this shit is not a copy. He says tweaking the UI, which is the visuals of the game. And adding features doesn't save your game from being a copy. I'm not even talking about the moves. Well, obviously, you can't talk about the moves considering these moves are the exact replication of the anime itself. He said your game as a whole is a reskinned rogue demon. You being unhappy with the... We'll, we'll get to that next. He says my game is a whole reskinned version of, of rogue demon, which I have to disagree with. And this game is called Rogue Slayers for a very simple purpose. It's not from me... <clears throat> deciding yo i'm gonna ch steal the name of rogue demon it's for two simple factors the first factor is rogue slayers was the first ever clan name i made in rogue demon and i decided to carry on that name because it was the most it was probably the funnest to the first clan i ever made in this game because it was generally the first clan ever created this was many years ago the second reason why is as your game is named Rogue Demon, which doesn't really make sense considering you can play Breathings and Demon Arts at the same time, this game doesn't allow you to play Demon Arts. I likely will never add it because all Demon Arts will be high scaled bosses that you could defeat for currency and rare drops such as auras, cosmetics, and things of that nature. This game is a completely skill based game with no grinding or levels. Anybody can join pick their breathing with the full move set and attempt to get rare items in the game chill with others there's there's a whole nother premise to it along with <clears throat> and you said saving adding features these features fundamentally change the aspect of the community itself and maybe you don't understand that because you don't even seem to be locked into your community and it, it brings me to another topic you you I feel like you perceived me as my my self proclamation of being loyal as betrayal because I made this game, but I first off felt the betrayal the minute we'll, we'll get into that in a minute. The point is this being considered a, a reskin. I, I can see how you can argue that. I do like the no end lag, um, <clears throat> no end lag, no delay, fast paced combat of Rogue Demon. It, by far, it's the funnest anime. In fact, I don't think there is a funner combat that I've experienced across Roblox. I mean. I like Apocalypse Rising too. It's a good game, but sure, if if you want to claim that I I copied your game because we we scripted a combat system with no in lag and fast paced combat and no and no combat lock, then that that's a fine argument. But the whole premise of the game, the whole visuals, the uh, the goal of the game, the achievements that you could obtain in the game are are completely different to uh, to Rogue Demon and. Um, I could see how you could say reskinned since the VFX UI, all of this stuff is non rushed. You, you acting like you don't make enough money from Rogue Demon to commission better UI and things of that nature. Um, and I'm not trying to sit here and say maybe you have your own justified reason for why you didn't 
upgrade Rogue Demon's visual. Maybe you wanted to keep it low optimized for the low end devices, whatever that may be. Um, but in terms of us being a copy, I don't see how that's possible. You know, I can I can see you saying that at this stage, but even at this stage, we have not even features. The playability of the game is entirely different. You do not have to be forced into a battlefield when you spawn in. That is one thing that completely changed the trajectory of road. This is that come that changes it not even from a battlegrounds. A battlegrounds game is a game that you spawn in or an instantly in battle. We've already taken off the battleground marker. You can't consider us a battleground when we have a safe zone that allows you to not be. I can't. I can't use my abilities here. I can't do anything. So, <clears throat> the next thing that you said is you said being unhappy with the features I don't add doesn't justify it either. Fair enough. You know, I'm not tr trying to sit here and say that every single thing that I ask you to add in should be add in. You know what I'm saying? But what I do ask is, is I guarantee that if you stayed consistently updating the game, this game would have never came into existence. And I'm not going to sit here and play the Bills card, but I'm going to play the Bills card. Rogue Demon is roughly 40 well now that number has dropped significantly it was 40 even at 1.50 to 60 percent of my income that i make now i'm sure you being an adult as well understand that well, i don't know about you i have mouse to feed i actually am responsible for a lot of other people and so when you when you when you neglect this game you not only neglect the content creators that that have to pay bills but you neglect the player base itself bro the game is dying in terms of player count and you know it you can you can go to view analytics you can see it it's like i can't you know I, and i even i said in the video i would offer a percent just for the inspiration that was accumulated i would consistently still play rogue demon as of right now i'm not banned from the game but i feel in a weird position to where i feel like i can't even i feel like it's disrespecting i don't know i feel like can i even play rogue demon again i i would like to it's my fun it, it currently the funnest game sorry i'm eating some bread it's currently the funnest game or one of them that that i can play and so it's like feeling almost castrated is uh i mean you had kept me castrated for 10 months anyways so Let's go ahead and get to the next thing you said. You said, actually, I want to get back on the me, me, you not being happy with the features I added, bruv. You know damn well that you have so much that you can update in this game in Rogue Demon. You didn't even, bro, Docky should have been out before that movie even came out. And then when that other movie came out, you should have been on Sonami and been on the other Hashira that was shown fighting in the anime. It is ridiculous that you weren't it really is bro because we were all looking forward to it we were all expecting it save bro you <sighs> rogue ninja rogue ninja right that it wasn't rogue ninja supposed to be released already i i just don't understand what your priorities are homie it seems that you as a developer got lucky off of rogue demon didn't expect it to reach the level it did took all the money well not took all the money in that aspect like some greedy monster but you you i mean money changes people bro and and i've been to the point where i've had over 100k in the bank so it's like it's it's an interesting situation so i i don't know really what to say much about that point the next thing you said which really left me with distaste you said bro even tried to justify leaking my unreleased missed alt to everyone was okay Brother, I DM'd a developer saying that I was going to upload. Do, do I need to show the DMs I met? I, I know I sent them to you after you forced me to. And I'm not saying that me leaking the missile was, was necessarily okay. Sure, I should have DM'd you. A dude that didn't even have me added on Discord. A dude that neglected me despite me being the number one content creator. I'm not trying to make you seem like the bad guy. But you ignored the shit out of me. On multiple occasions um you neglected the spams and again you neglected the spam dms and and practically begging that i wanted for you to update the game because i wanted you bro i didn't want you to just update the game just so i could get pulled some views off an update video and bro when i saw the player count of rogue demon big 
it left me with pride. I felt pride seeing the game being successful. I th that's a different type of loyalty. When you are happy when someone else is primarily winning despite the wins that I could have gotten from any activity, it's insane to me. It's insane to me, bro. I'm genuinely a loyalist. And like I said, I asked very respectfully. I told the developer that I was going to post this on YouTube. I'm not trying to put them any deep in the dirt than you already did with your whole response to that. But <clears throat> I was very respectful about it. I told him, hey, I need some content. The game's been boom, boom, boom. I want to make a video. Then, and, and it's not even like... I understand, sure, I'm, I, let, let's go ahead and take your thing for example, let's say I didn't tell them I was going to upload it, and I just posted it anyways, right, bro, you quite literally DM'd me, solarly, you DM'd basically some of your biggest content creators, and you threatened to in-game ban us if we didn't tell you who, and I understand who, 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 we explained to you. I explained to you. I don't know what he said. I explained to you. I had no idea that this wasn't allowed. I thought it was allowed. I didn't want to say the name because I didn't want to get that person in trouble. But then you're threatening to ban me, which is basically threatening to stop food from going into people's I care about mouse, including my own, taking care of my dog, my girls, some of her, some of her bills and medical bills and things of that nature. My grandmother, my mother, my brother, you're literally trying to like, like, bro, I don't think you realize what you've done. You kind of power abused the shit out of me. I would never in my life threaten a, a content creator like that. That is literally, you know, spending their income on necessities of life. And I'm not going to say that that's all I spent it on. I've obviously, you know, went around here and there, did some fun things and things of that nature. But it's insane to me that you are, are going to justify your response to me, to me, quote unquote, leaking the mistle, bro. You, bro, if you don't sit here and, and take some accountability that that was too far, you're insane to me. I even take accountability for my original ban. Sure, I shouldn't have said that even though it was legal and there's legal doctrines claiming that I could do what I said I would do in the case of a life endangered emergency which is the threat that was proposed upon me by the individual that made those proclamations now next you said breaking down rogue demons individual features as not being original rogue demon doesn't mean you can assemble them the same way and it's not going to be a copy so you said original features the only original features that i could honestly see about rogue demon and maybe I'm wrong, is what, what would be genuinely original? Because there's bot battlegrounds all the time that do 5M1s. You could do 4M1 combo. Four, like, I don't understand. It, the, the M1s aren't the same. I guess you could say the UI loadout. Wait, you want me to twist the breathing bar there, put the health bar at the top? Like, I, I don't understand what, what, the, what the argument is. I don't see how you, what, what genuine originality things are in rogue demon you can't even play a demon art in this game my friend there will never be a demon art that you could play we have literal bosses with important drops i don't understand how i could be considered the game the same we have a like i i don't want to leak too much because you know there's a lot of things coming to this game that differ us from any game to ever exist in the battlegrounds anime game space but it's like I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. What 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 does Rogue Demon have that's original? Move stacking, which we don't have in this game, and you never even intended to have that be a thing. Afro dashing, which was never intended to be a thing, but that was already a thing in Blocks Fruits, anyways. Um, what what did we copy that a Rogue Demon originally made? I mean, bro, Rising Sun is the exact name of Blazing Sun, which is the ability you tried to make, right? Or was it Blazing Universe? The functionality of the ability itself is completely different. I don't under... I'm trying to think here. Unknowing Fire, right? We tried to uh, 
do it with a uh, I mean we see y'all did it with a, the a character velocity which became kind of difficult to do with our our function of doing it I'm trying to think what what did we copy oh, what the map the the loadout of the map maybe maybe it's the map well first off buddy's charging me 350k robux for a uh, uh, the new village and a battlegrounds map that's just kind of like wow i mean i have the 350k but you know what's going to fund the you know sponsorships you know i'm trying to get to a million robux which is uh a hefty price to 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 reach i'm trying to think the map is it really the map it can't be the map is it really the map what because we use the same open sourced buildings like bro I made if you want me to I can go to the descriptor the that built this game and we could go to his game that was made in 2000 and what is it 15 before you even when you were in elementary school we were both in elementary school and he had a game with this exact same map build a Dragon Ball game so it's like calling that the, the reason why it's a copy is absurd not to mention this beautiful clan building that's not top five though we're gonna have to fix that aren't we so you like take this over boom 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 all right i don't think i can get in here all right the point is you well actually i can but you know i just have feature i'm sorry look this is this is my perspective of it i just listen i consistently dm'd you with features that i wanted to be added in in rogue rogue demon that i felt would save the player base and save the community and have a more engaging active community and bro don't sit here and say i'm not a loyalist bro let's talk about let's talk about rogue demon stars a whole concept that i consistently wanted you to bring into genuine fruition and um you cucked me basically rogue demon stars is something i've spent roughly three thousand dollars on hosting tournaments keeping you know the community engaged in fun active events go to my live streams look at rogue demon stars tournaments look at rogue demon stars 5v5 na tournament that was probably the funnest tournament i've ever been in we actually won it my clan which was insane considering we went against some of the best players in the entire uh community i just don't know what much to say homie it's like i got a lot of love for you because you know you could have made my my life a lot harder and career a lot harder in terms of playing rogue demon but to sit and say that you know you said it yourself in the announcements you you tried your best to treat me fairly and that's exactly what every game owner should do to everyone treat people fairly you know what i'm saying it's like I feel like you trying to say that I somehow am you trying to say that I'm somehow like not deserving of fairness is absurd. I match the community around me, homie. When I reached the pinnacle, when I became the strongest clan, I had toxic ass people in the community that were just toxic. And the way I treated toxic people is if you were toxic to me, I would respond with that toxicity 10 times worse. That's how I operated because in my eyes, when people were toxic to me, it was like attacking me. And I felt like if you, it's like if you're on the streets and someone, you know, punches you or pushes you, you don't want to, you don't want to let them think that that's okay. Cause then they'll do it forever and take your stuff and maybe rob you. So you respond with knocking their face in, right? That's how I perceived it. Until obviously I had, uh, I guess you could say found God in the aspect that being a good person, being a kind person will bring you more happiness in life. And being happy is, is subjective, bro. I could think I'm happy sitting, eating mcdonald's every day not really caring just doing what i want but that's not truly happy homie it's not 
and I'm saying this all because I feel like being and marketing a community that I can't and I don't want to say control but I can't end problems from the core is is just absurd to me you know what I mean like there are people that are loud in the rogue diva community that have sat and made they've sat and took in samples of my voice and made AI voice audio of me saying the most outrageous things Where, do they do they get punished? No, I mean, bro. I've thought about you know because I do uh, I do have a lawyer. I've thought about you know defamation of a public figure, lost wages for the negative impact that they've had on my influence, emotional distress for the mental health effects of their defamation. You know, I've thought about genuinely suing these people. But then what about their parents, right? Their parents are going to end up having to pay the, the bill or their, their file for bankruptcy, just all this crap. And it's not nice things. It's not being good. It's not a good, kind-hearted move to make. So I, I just feel like I'm in a very odd position. You know, I feel like you've practically done guilt trip me into almost not wanting to make the game because I'm going to affect you. But... Bro, look at where you put allocate your resources from from the the fruitful benefits of the project that you created. You know, I feel like generosity is important. The sin of greed is one of the worst sins. Pride is is arguably one of the worst sins cuz you could be so prideful to to even claim that you're a deity. I mean, I experienced it myself. That's why I've come to the conclusion that we are all made up of the same atoms. We are all made up of the same biological makeup. We are all capable of the same thoughts. I'm no different from anybody watching this video or anybody else on earth. We are all, we all have a dark side. You know, when we're five years old, we're, and we start school, you know, our, our families tell us, don't be bad at school. You're gonna get kicked out. You're gonna get spanked. You're gonna get in trouble. And so we take all of those negative con negative emotions, not connotations, negative feelings, and we store them to the back of our mind so that we don't act out at school. But what that does is it does one of two results. Either it's bottled up and will explode at any given moment. Or number two, you, um, you, know, you start developing problems because you get these intrusive thoughts that you can't eliminate. And, and the best bet is just to to use these emotions to push you in a path of success and success without deterring anyone else and that's a hard thing to do you know what i'm saying i just it's a hard it's a hard situation um it's just Trying to trying to be a, a the best person that you can be is incredibly important. I think that everybody should focus on it. Um, you know, even me, I'm I'm still at battle. If if people knew, and I say this a lot of the times, I just don't want to go into it. You know, I don't want to feel like I'm dragging people that I care about and love, despite them telling me they wish I would die. Even though I give them thousands of dollars a month to keep them safe. Even though I was, I just don't even want to go into these things. Because I feel like I'm playing the victim card. The last thing I'm going to do is play a victim card. But to sum it up, I'm practically an orphan. By, by just, it's just, it could go on and on. And I'm not going to sit here and say, though, that's why I'm toxic. Oh, because my environment was raised in manipulation and physical violence, that means that that justifies my toxicity or things of that nature. It's just important that everybody tries to follow God's will. Going to church doesn't mean you're going to heaven and things of that nature. It's important to just love everybody, even your enemies, because at the end of the day, 
For example, bullying works the same way as cyberbullying and as it does in real life. You know, if someone's bullying you at school, there's something going on with them either mentally or something at home. There's something wrong. If you ever get bullied at school, ask your bully. Listen, I know you're having fun letting out your problems, venting your aggression, but what's what's happening with you at home? What's going on? Because genuinely that it it's it's likely the case. I mean, who who bullies people unless who bullies people for no reason? Like genuinely no reason, nothing. Like you think they're doing it for no reason until you look at their life. You know, I've experienced these things from from little, you know, dealing with certain situations in life. And so it works the same online, bro. If somebody is just openly being toxic to you, lying on your name, doing whatever, there's something going on in their life that is causing that effect. And you need to just, you need to understand that they're human too. They feel pain, they cry, they're happy, they're sad. And uh, try to try to try to resonate and sympathize. You know what I mean? That doesn't mean you got to be their friend and hang out. But you know, the the imp- most important feeling is acceptance and not being in denial of of the situation. You know what I mean? That's the most important thing. Because if you're in denial and you can't accept it, then you'll never be able to fix it. So, you know that that's really the ba- the main premise I could tell you guys for this video and to Ahmed, like I said, um, this game's uh, production will be different in in aspects that make it game changing. I like to compare it like GTA Five to GTA Six. You know what I'm saying? I feel like, you know, I wanted to stick around, but I have to up my own consistency to where it's unhealthy for me to maintain a sustainable uh, income. And I still, because I still have to give X amount of money to charities still host giveaways help feed my families and things family and things of that nature it's just not it's not as easy as you'd like to think you know i i may be 18 years old but i've had a lot of responsibility a lot i've been paying taxes 1099 w2 since i was what almost 15 so 14 years old like it's not fun bro it's not fun when you're forced to be an adult but it does you know help the development of your prefrontal cortex develop a lot stronger my mental fortitude and things of that nature to be much more sustainably strong especially if i'm able to stand on business so i think that's all i have to say i love every single person watching this video fan hater you know in terms of making a rogue demon video again i don't know i love rogue demon i even love the majority of the community I just am in a position where I'm not really sure if if it's the play. You guys let me know in the comments. I love you guys. Peace.